don't know if you can see my jeans. Thousands of mosquitoes are biting my, biting through my clothing. I can't even believe I need this. Sometimes I wonder about myself. Mosquitoes, mosquitoes. Hi Keys Mods fan, David Fine here. And I've got a video that I filmed a couple years ago while doing my moth surveying research up in the Northern Keys and up in North Key Largo. And it was one of those things which it's kind of like the mosquitoes were so bad that you just can't even believe that you're crazy enough to continue doing this work. Guys, I just wanted to show you what it looks like when you're up in North Key Largo, middle of the summer, and you're trying to survey moths and the mosquitoes, the salt marsh mosquitoes are just rampant. Guys, it was unbearable. And we're setting out traps. There's not a whole lot of moths in this video, but we're setting out traps and, and we get mauled. So check it out. Like, subscribe, and share. Let's get to it. Anyway, we're here in June and we are here with the BioBlitz uh, 2017. And what I wanted to do is, I wanted to try and show what the, the, the insanity of the mosquitoes when you walk into this place in the summer. Uh, I don't know if you can see them buzzing around me. Uh, already, but uh, we're gonna, I'm going to walk down that trail and see if we can show you what's up. This is uh, almost 10 miles of, of hammock here. This, uh, the, the east side of the road, there he is, he's, he's free now. The east side of the road is uh, belongs to the state of Florida, and that's the um, North Key Largo Botanical Site. And the right side of the road is all Crocodile Lake National Wildlife Refuge, which is federally owned. And this is the site I have the permits for. Agree that every time we come out here, it's we're finding different things, new things. It's very exciting. So, we'll see what we can uh, come up with here. I'm looking for a trail on this side of the road. So you need you need a little like a trail works nice or a clearing, uh, but when you're putting lights out on a little trail like this on the side of a highway. Here's our trail. While we're here. So now open it. Alright, mosquitoes are starting to hit me. 
soon as I get as soon as I get out of the truck, they're hitting me like crazy. So I am going to lock the traps first. refuge says this is the worst he's ever seen it he lives here you know the mosquitoes are bad we're good to go hopefully I don't know if you can see my jeans Thousands of mosquitoes are biting my biting through my clothing as I'm trying to work. It's amazing to me that people actually lived here before. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, let's get out. 
Words can't even express how how maddening this is to have a mosquito that bad on you. We're driving. Uh, tonight's our <coughs> our public event. We're actually going to set up a, a light trap in the uh, the Crocodile Lake National Wildlife Refuge uh, headquarters. Uh, I don't think the mosquitoes are as bad in that area, but I might be wrong. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to try and gain my composure and my sanity because supposedly the public is going to come and uh, learn about moths tonight. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. I want to see who else is as crazy as I am. So uh, I'll show you guys more in a bit. <sighs> Wish me luck. Wish me luck. Well, comment down below. Would you continue on with the research if that is what you'd have to do in order to continue to uh, find moths? Guys, the mosquitoes were so bad. Even the refuge manager said this is the worst he'd ever seen him. The guy lives in North Key Largo. So if he said it's the worst he'd ever seen him, unbearable. But uh, that's part of the deal. The salt marsh mosquitoes in the Florida Keys are absolutely, it's horrific. Uh, on certain times of the year, but it's what we have to do in order to get the research and the data and finding these new things that we're finding down the Florida Keys uh, part of the deal. So guys, uh, if you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. Hit the bell for notifications because we've got some great videos lined up for you on our research down here in South Florida on the butterflies and moths and much, much more. So guys, hope you enjoyed. Take care. Stay safe.